Okay, so this is the story of the prank chicken feet. So it was... Ema corrected me on this. I thought that we, she had gone to a kosher butcher and she was surprised when she brought it home. But she actually went to uh, the apple market when it was here in Moraga. And she wanted a, a kosher chicken. And so she ordered it and she saw that they had um, included the feet and the neck and the innards. And she um, said, oh, she, she didn't really want that. And uh, so they, they wrapped it up and she thought that they had left the feet. But when she got home, she got the chicken, she put it in the sink, and then she started to unpack it. And sure enough, the first thing that come out was uh, one of the feet. And so that's when she screamed and called for me. So I came over and I looked at the chicken and it was pretty gross looking. It was sitting there in the sink and one foot was sticking out of it. And, you know, I had to go in there and dig the other foot out and dig the neck out and dig the gizzards out. And, uh, and then I had a thought and I realized that the, uh, that Zach and Jenna were in the family room right next to the kitchen there and they were watching TV. So I said, aha, I know. So I, uh, turned the hot water on and I waited for all kinds of steam to come out of the hot water and then I put my uh, hands up in my sleeve and then I realized that if I stuck my hands in my sleeve and then I grabbed the chicken feet they would look like my hands at the end of my you know sleeve so uh, after the steam got really you know pretty intense I screamed, oh, I burned my hands, I burned my hands, oh, help, help me. And then I could hear them jump up and run around and come into the kitchen. As soon as they started coming into the kitchen, I turned around and I had these little claws sticking out of the ends of my sleeves and uh, they just screamed. It was really, really, well, Maybe it wasn't that wonderful because it was pretty scary. <laughs> but anyway, that's the story of the, the chicken feet.